I don't care about the color of the lips that the word falls out of. During your time with the Black Panther Party mm -hmm. in New Haven, mm -hmm. how did Panther members refer to each other? Or to Americans of African descent? Oh, as black people. Did they ever use the N-word, the, the, the word nigger? No, that was not a commonly used word. Why was it not? Because we didn't feel that it was ever used in a respectful way. Um, it comes out of the history of slavery and Jim Crow and was a taunt even during the time of the Civil Rights Movement um, to put Negroes in their place. Um, and so it was often used in the community around us as a friendly term. That's my nigga, you know, that nigga over there, oh you know, that nigga stay around the way. Um, like that. And it wasn't as if that wasn't what we used before we joined the Black Panther Party, but we were believed in respectfully treating ourselves and others because we've been so disrespected. And it's a form of internalized racism, I feel, to use the word in reference to other black people of, or people of color that aren't necessarily directly of African descent in the United States, but who are of African descent. Um, and then the term, in the 60s, the term was becoming popular in a rhetorical kind of way, in an artistic kind of way, and then it took off later in a disparaging kind of way. But no, we did not, we did not use that to, when I say we, I'm not talking about the Black Panther Party of 1966 and Eldridge Cleaver, for instance, because he used all kinds of terms. Um, and they were probably valuable for him at the time. But the party lasted until 1982, and that just wasn't a word we used in writing or in speaking to describe black people or the descendants of enslaved Africans. So you definitely would oppose the use of that word? I do, but I cannot impose upon others what they use. I can only say I choose not to, and most of the people around me choose not to. And I work with a group of young poets um, in, the, in Northern California, in Oakland, around the East Bay area, and they choose not to, to further the ignorance that's already there. Do you think there's a difference between, between when uh, Americans of African descent say it versus non? Not for me, no. It's, it may be friendlier if African Americans use the term. It may be just as demeaning as it is when a white person uses the term. I don't care about the color of the lips that the word falls out of. <laughs>